What's up guys, in this video we will be taking a look of the Liquid Smooth ROM which is available for your Nexus 5 device. Now the Android version that currently I am running with this ROM is uh, the Android version of 5.0.2 which is the latest version that comes along with this build, with this Liquid Smooth build. And also you will be getting the Liquid Smooth updates. As you can see I have already got the updates on my Liquid Smooth ROM and you can just tap on it to download the updates and you'll be up to date with this ROM if you install it and also the best thing that comes along with this ROM is that it will be pre-rooted for instance you don't need to root your device once you flash the, this ROM and the G apps as you can see my device is now rooted so I don't need to root my device again after flashing this ROM and uh, let's go into a settings option and see uh, the customization that we'll be getting with this ROM you can see uh, in the device option the liquid smooth option is available where you'll be able to change your equalizer interface navigation notification status bar and also advanced so when you go into your equalizer you will be so you'll be able to set up your audio effects on your phone speaker or your headset or your bluetooth device or usb dock so audio effects has been a built-in function of the liquid smooth ROM and also when you go into your interface you'll be able to change your LCD density if you know something about this you, you can change it or if not you just leave it where it is you'll be also getting the option to the toggle off to disable the Google search in your recent for instance you can see the Google search isn't available and when you just toggle it off you can see the Google search bar will be available so this can be also done through this ROM and when you go into your navigation option you can set up your gestures at what application will be you will be able to access through what gesture on this on your nexus 5 and also you'll be able to change your navigation bar height uh, you can see that you can set up your dp as uh, 40 dp it just decreases the bar height and also default it increases and also you'll be able to change set up your notification for instance your notification light for what application and you can see the pulse uh, length will be set it set up you can see the long you can see the pulse light be taken longer to blink you can see here so it's always on and uh, very short custom okay so this can also be done through your notification light option and also when device is locked for instance if you lock your device and a notification comes it doesn't show the content that comes along with the notification you'll be only getting the application name and uh, that's all when you just toggle this uh, or when you select this uh, option and also you'll be able to set up your notification app notification for instance if you want to block this calculator or the the notification that you that you get from a certain application you can just block it and uh, or you can just toggle the priority option on from your app notification and also your snoozer time and timeout you can set it up and also when you go into your status bar you can see you can set up your battery percentage the incoming and outgoing uh, your internet data and also you can set up your brightness control the toggle on the brightness control the double tap to sleep when you just tap on the status bar you will be your device will be locked so that also you can do from your status bar option and also you can sh uh, toggle the show weather option you can see towards the right side right now my location service is uh, disabled so the weather isn't showing or else if you keep if you turn on the location service the weather will be displayed towards the right side and also you can toggle on the notification count on your nexus 5 and also your clock date battery status each and everything and when you go into your advanced option you will be able to block ads on your nexus 5 by just ticking on this box here so this has also been introduced in the liquid smooth rom and also you can block your unwanted calls through your blacklist which is a included into this rom so this is also a good thing and your buttons option you will be able to uh, set up your buttons option for instance if you want to end, end the call you can just press the power button and your call will be uh, ended and also your answer button each and everything double tap action as what can be done and also the menu button the volume wake wake up device uh, when just uh, switch on the device when you just toggle uh, press the volume up and volume down you can uh, see the device will be waking up so this can be also done through your buttons option and when you go into your display option you can see your ambient display is also available and also lift to wake option is available when you just keep your device to the table and a notification comes and just lift your device it will be 
your your device will be your your display will be waken up and also when you go into your storage option you can see you can view your partition info uh, on your device and also your media scan behavior for instance when you boot reboot your device it you can set it up to ask to scan or do not scan media or scan media you can do it from your storage option and also your system profiles option is available where you can set up your profile as what profile suits you so you can do it through your system profiles and also when you go into your security option as you can see i have kept my application shortcuts on the lock screen and if i want to access them you just have to tap tap and hold and you'll be taken into your application so that can be done through your security options when you go into your shortcuts you can set up your application by just tapping on this plus icon and going to what application you want for instance like music and your music application will be displayed on your lock screen so this has also been introduced in your liquid smooth rom so these are the settings that you'll be getting from the liquid smooth rom sorry liquid smooth rom and also your usb debugging notify each and everything is already on so this is liquid smooth rom and also the applications that you'll be getting pre-installed with this rom is the sound recorder you can see the sound recorder will become will be pre-installed onto your device when you flash this rom on your nexus 5 and also the camera you can see the camera interface is totally different here you'll be only getting your camera and video recording option that's it when you flash this rom and uh, also the messaging application will be totally different you can see the messaging application so this is liquid smooth rom i'll be leaving the files in the description and uh, if you want to flash this rom you can just flash it uh, the rom and also the g apps and also i'll be showing you the animation that comes along with this rom as you'll be seeing right now you can see the liquid smooth rom animation that you'll be getting on your device so I really like the way the animation, uh, the Liquid Smooth ROM has its animation. You can see the Liquid Smooth ROM logo here and everything. So this was my preview of the Liquid Smooth ROM. It's really smooth, fast, and rate of the battery life. It depends on the user. If you are a heavy user, you'll be getting a decent battery life if you are a light user you'll be getting a normal battery life so for me i i get almost one and a half day or even with heavy usage with excessive usage i get around one day of battery life while using this liquid smooth rom so if you like this video please do give it a thumbs up and also do follow me on facebook twitter instagram and google plus till then i'll be seeing you in my next video